couple of goals, 5 0 win. How long have you, as a, as a team and individual, been waiting for a, a game like this? Yeah, look, I think it was just a matter of time before everything clicked. I think we've been putting in some good performances um, at Barnsley and then at the weekend on Friday against Watford. Um, and it just clicked today. You know, we. We took our chances, which maybe we haven't quite done in, in previous games. Um, you know, it turned out to be a really enjoyable game. Second half, personally, yeah, managed to get two goals, which is always nice. Um, being overdue, some um, and all in all, it was a great, you know, a great win and a great. I think it was a good reaction, seeing as how we started the game, bottom of the league after the results. Um, you know, we've sent a statement out. You know, we're not giving up. We're really positive that we can get out of this situation and to score five against a team like Cardiff who are pushing for the playoffs to keep the clean sheet. You know, it's only good steps and hopefully we can take that to QPR. You talk about a, a statement for a team that's struggled to score goals this season to put five past Cardiff. What, what do you take from this, both the result and the performance as a group of players? I think belief more than anything, belief that we can score goals and we can keep clean sheets and we can win games against good teams because we've got lots of lots of tough games coming up before now and the you know the end of the season and we need to we need to win games and in order to do that you need to keep clean sheets but and you certainly have to score goals as well so we've done both of those things and it's about a reaction again we'll come in tomorrow work hard and get ready for QPR on Saturday. How important was the start to the second half in particular? Because at three nil, a good lead, but if Cardiff had, you'd allowed them a little sniff back in, it could have been different. But a professional second half. Yeah, definitely. They they started the second half. They had a few long throws and a few corners, so we had to ride the wave a little bit. Um, and we knew if we got a chance, if we scored the fourth, then that's game over, and that's what we did. Um, and then after that, I think it was superb game management. We moved the ball well. We still created chances. You know, we got a fifth. Um, but most importantly, I think we kept that back door shut because a clean sheet does the the goalie, the, not just the back five, but the team defensively as a whole. You know, a lot of positives, and we can take that. And now it's about we need to back that up with the win against QPR on Saturday. In terms of the goals, the first one straight off the the training ground, executed to perfection as a group. Yeah, look, we scored some really good goals today. Um, some great finishes from Pato, Julian, a great header. You know, we worked a little free kick. Um, and I just saw a ruthlessness that we haven't probably showed in in a very long time, probably all season. Um, but the boys are confident in there. We're confident that we can get out of this situation. We're playing some good football and and, and now we're, we're doing the other side of the game by winning games as well. Um, so the lads can take confidence from today. And like I keep reiterating, it's, it's about the reaction again on Saturday. We need to go and go and win games. We need to win four or five more games if we want to get out of it.